Hello everyone, welcome back to A Hat in Time. In this part, we are headed to that place. Looks nice, don't you think? Um, I don't think I've unlocked anything to getting to it. The birds at the birdhouse steal shiny things, and, well, our timepiece is a shiny thing. Now, I already see that thing's green. It usually means we're done an area. So, the birdhouse is this way. The birdhouse is this way. Oh god, I already do not like this place. Um, between having to walk. Oh! Walk on these wires and. Yeah. I'm already not a big fan of this place. Okay, I just walked to the end of that one and it jumped me off. Because you saw I didn't jump. This time I did. Oh, well, how nice of you, random bush. I think we're still doomed, but how nice of you. So I don't think it's expecting me to be able to get out of that. On the bright side, this is still pre um, the challenge. So. Yeah, it's just the end of that one doesn't exist. Make sure you swing towards the path you want. Swing towards the path you want. Well, there's there's only one path here. I I really want yeah. that yarn. I am really okay with that end result. Uh, extremely okay with that. I'm gonna go to this path. Come on, let me go to that path. Yeah, there's only one path to go on. I don't know what they're talking about. Swing towards the path you want. I guess there's gonna be a horn over here. That's all I can figure. Serpentine at bird the top. So we're we're getting into a habit in these ones already. What's up here? What's on the top of this area? Nothing. Well, at least that's interesting. We also still only have one health. So I don't know if I want to die to these birds. Because I mean, 1 HP, if I die to the birds, then at least I'll have full HP again. There, we're up to 2 HP. Ugh, you. The checkpoint. Uh, but that's that's only part of the way up to the horn, unfortunately. Take the two hearts, I need both. I'm just gonna dodge these guys. And some beams will be enough. And this should open up the other yellow path, which is why they tell you, hey, lean the way you want. I guess this one's meant to be one of the earlier ones you do? It's free roam, so I guess all of them are meant to be your first one, but still. The interesting thing is... Yeah, you can see the bottom, like, right there. And it looks like that one actually leads us straight into the bird cage, which is very helpful because that means we're going right to the next 
uh, timepiece. This one will might well might be a shorter one. No, it's looking like there's another stop off in between. Yeah, we start down here and we have to go up there. Being said, that doesn't sound like the worst thing in the world. I think the interesting thing is it's finally requiring us to use the Vivian hat. Because no, there's no one other than Vivian that I see when I'm wearing this color hat. And Vivian's awesome, so not a bad thing that we see Vivian. To the point where even if I was to get another one, I probably wouldn't use it. What do you say? You're nearly at the birdhouse. Thank you. Uh, I don't think the birdhouse is over that way, though. So. Yeah. I do like this one. It's a nice destructive course. And does this mean there's one for each of our hats? Because I know the Twilight Bell is for certain uh, one that's designed to use your um, Dweller's Mask. I, there's no doubt in my mind that that's what that is. Oh, can I, can I hit that thing down here? No, alright, I gotta put it here. Shift, bro. Drops and balances everything back out. But I mean, yeah, without using the um, dweller's mask, you can't. I wish I would have looked before I ran all the way up there. Oh, we got it though. I'm okay with that. And in fact, that brings us up to the birdhouse path. I'm, I'm liking this one. It's like the lava cake. It wasn't too, too much work to get to it. I know we didn't get our treasure chest in this one, and that is something we're missing now. Uh, but we're at the birdhouse. This was like 15 minutes into the last part when we did it. Uh, we do not, however, have enough uh, pawns to get this next part. So I think at the birdhouse, we're expecting lots of these crows. And that's to be expected, really. There's probably, yeah, uh, that guy as well. He's nice and dangerous, but I don't think... There's something strange about some of those... They can blow up the, um... Interesting, they can actually blow up the uh, bales of hay. I don't know if that's all of them that they can blow up, or just some of them. But I mean, as long as we keep moving, we should be fine. You have to avoid Elvis here, trying to push us places. Yeah, honestly, oh. Inside that hay was a brewing yarn. I was wondering if we could hear what the agents of Ka had to say. And you can't push them off either. Which, I mean, I guess is fine. Oh, it looks like we actually missed. Oh, we gotta go in from a different angle. Alright. This big guy, I don't feel we can make that jump, but maybe from on top we might be able to? So, yeah, we gotta go this way. But that is a nice little, you can see the agents of Kaw in what I assume is their natural habitat. I'm like, did, did I just get trapped here? Yeah. 
so you can open up this side, which gives you access to over here. And ta-da, we get this Rift Token. Yeah, it, it's a guaranteed Rift Token at this point since we've gotten all of the um, relics that would have been. So I think the crayons and the crayon box are what should be popping up in this area. I like this whole punk house, nice and spiky. Ooh, that's a little dangerous. Dangerous, I would even say. Which is probably why I think it's as dangerous as it is. Oh, come on, I was on that. So you can use your ice ability to sneak through here and see another rift token? Yeah, it's a rift token. I don't think we quite need that. So, we can climb up even higher now. All that's really left at this point I was wondering if I could blow this up from a distance with this. Oh, there's a I guess I have to use this to get over there. I wasn't expecting that. Uh, there's a horn here which opens the path you need to to get to the bird who rolled over in his sleep. I think we're at the end, guys. That is what seems to be the end of this area. The bird is on its back. And it's bouncy. That is very helpful. I don't think we could have got up here without it. And that's timepiece 24. Um, everything but the twilight bell in this area is done. These flowers keep seeming to bloom, but they don't seem very important, so let's not worry about them. All that's left is that bell in the background. But that will be next time. We will finally get our revenge on the... Wow, that was 13 minutes? We will finally get our revenge on the Twilight Bell. Yeah, it's just a bit sad that the episodes are as inconsistent timed as they are. It's just it's a downside of... Well, some of them require us getting to this guy, and some of them don't. Some of them have like 10 or 15 parts in the center. We need to go. Uh, some of them are just, you're there, okay, you're done. So, in the next part, we will head to the Twilight Bell and hopefully complete it. See you guys then.